Good morning, dreamers. How are you today? Today is a good day for a good day. So I have to tell you about something that happened last night. Sorry, the rest of the coffee is still going and I want the second cup, so I did not turn it off. Um, so something that happened to me yesterday and then again, like literally just now, um, I have something to show you. Be careful, watch your eyeballs. So this is my light, right? We've all seen them because we, um, we're a Zoom culture. We've needed to become one. And so we've all seen ring lights, although this is a cheapo whatever. But I was using it last night um, to do my fingernails because I was, um, I'm an old lady. And so I need a little extra light, but it wasn't, it wasn't lighting up the, I'm like, oh, the battery's dead. So I did not go to Amazon and woo, 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 there we go. I didn't go to Amazon and order a new one and throw this one out. I charged it. I found the cord. I had to do some digging because I'm an old lady and forget where I put stuff, but I charged the light and now it's very bright. I'm looking like a ghost today. Stop. And then this morning I had my cup of coffee. Okay. Put it down on the table in front of me. <clears throat> and as I was setting up, I knocked my coffee. I didn't spill it completely over, but I jostled it and out came hot coffee. It's on my shirt. It's on my pants. And I'm like, hmm, I'm gonna have to wash these. So when I'm done here, I'm gonna have to go change and find something else to wear and throw this in the wash. But I didn't think in my head, oh, I better throw those out. I had to clean them and I had to restore them. But I didn't, I also didn't throw out the mug that still has some great coffee in it, by the way. Uh, Starbucks, not a sponsor. Um, but so I didn't throw it out though because it offended me or it messed up or it spilled what was in it. I didn't throw out the light because it needed to be recharged. You see, when God created you, he made you an image bearer of himself. And there is divine in you. And when you fumble, and when you, sorry, it rhymes, stumble in life, and when you're making decisions that aren't the greatest, he doesn't say, throwing you out. He says, there's divine in there. There's some good stuff in there but you need to recharge. You need to be refilled. You need to be washed. And so he does not throw out his creation. So when we as creation start to look at others and throw them out because they don't quite fit how you are thinking they should be, we are actually playing a very dangerous game when we start to throw other people out. Their views on vaxes don't match mine. Their views on social justice don't match mine. I'm so much more progressive than they are. Give it up. They are being who they've been created to be. And if that's straight laced conservative, you embrace that and love them. I'm preaching to myself now, but God doesn't throw out, so don't you throw out. Don't start to throw out yourself either. The mug could look at itself in the computer image and say, oh, I'm a horrible mug. I have nothing good within me and anything that comes out burns people and they don't like me. I'm gonna throw myself out. Muggers don't do that. I know my brother calls it my habit of disnifying things, you know, like little chip in um, Beauty and the Beast. And I'm not saying be a mug. I'm saying there's value in you. So if something comes out and you're burned or you've burned someone else, make it right. Sometimes we need to go apart and 
charge, be plugged in, be plugged into the source of the divine, which is almighty God himself. And sometimes we need to just take a rest and charge, turn everything off so we can charge better, more fully. Sometimes we need to take time out of, you know, the wear and tear of everyday life and go to the spa, go get washed, go get dried, whatever. <laughs> and sometimes we just need to be patted dry and embraced and the value within us seen. Hope you're understanding my object lessons today. This is how God speaks to me in my everyday life and I'm just eh, sharing it with you. Have a wonderful day and take some time for some sweet dreams too, okay? Bye.